nothing but I do anything that you want me to do Put you on the flight, I put you on the yacht, all this for you, yeah, yeah I'm just trying to express my love Hopefully it's enough, cause baby all I see is you Is you, cause baby all I see is you Yeah, cause baby all I see is you What's good, DZ family? Welcome back to our channel. It's your boy Zay, and we are back with another amazing video. If this your first time watching our family, don't mind us. We exhausted guys. We've been in the hospital. We just want to let you all know for all the support and all the things that you all have done for our family and just showed us so much love during this time. Just want to let you know right now that we appreciate you so much. Um, as you all can see from the title below, and I'm sure the thumbnail, Today is the day that we are going home. We've been at this hospital for about three, four days. Um, these three, four days has felt like a week. Yeah. Um, and the reason we're here, and we've been here so long, if you don't know, haven't watched the past videos, make sure you stop, or after this video, go ahead and do so. Desiree had a C-section. So yeah. with the C-section, it's required that you stay three days, three days minimum, um, just so they can make sure your scar is good, make sure you're not hemorrhaging, you're not bleeding. Um, etc. But it's been fun. It's been a crazy experience, um, especially with me being on this couch. But how do you feel overall? Um, I don't know. This whole experience, like you said, was like crazy. Uh, it definitely was a journey. But um, overall, I'm feeling pretty decent. As long as I walk, as long as I, you know, take like gas pills and stuff like that, I'd be good. So I just have to stay in that routine. So I'm going to have to have an updated routine. I can't just go to sleep no more, wake up when I want to. I gotta make sure I'm walking, make sure I'm active, stay down. Like, I can't go outside, guys, for like six weeks. Yeah. So, it's gonna be crazy. We're gonna see how this goes. We're gonna see, we'll take it day by day. But, yeah, that's how I'm feeling. But I know who y'all here to see y'all, so let me yeah. take y'all over there right now, show y'all a couple things as we get ready. So I just got done feeding the baby. Um, I actually slept pretty decent. This is the first time she kind of slept through the whole night. But what is the whole night if we're going to sleep at 4 a.m.? So um, it's currently like 12 o'clock, 12, 1 o'clock in the afternoon. But I wound up feeding her on my little spot and didn't want to move her right here because she's always known for waking up. So she's been good. She sleep. She knocked out. And um, <laughs> let's see how long she stay like that. But... I also want to kind of show y'all um, the car seat that we chose temporarily, but I think this is a pretty good, I don't know if you all have ever heard, I'm sure if you have kids, you've heard of Graco. Um, we chose a black car seat just because it's simple, it goes with everything in the cars that we have, and I think it's the most comfort-wise, like neck-wise, because with her being so small, you got to kind of put something around her neck because her first time in the car seat is going to look like it's just yeah. like you put a grape inside a Jeep. Like that's how small she looks compared to um, like the car seat aspect. I know that probably really didn't make sense. But yeah, we're going to be getting this stuff together. The food was decent. Um, I've, we ate out ever since we've been here. But yeah. anything else? Some good food. I know I need to go shopping for like personal items. <sighs> it's just, like I said, it's different routine, and that's part of our lunch call. Right? Yeah. Are y'all getting lunch? All right, let's see who that is. Let's see. I'm sure it's probably lunch. Hello? Yes. So we're one, we're checking out. Yes, we're leaving. All right, thank you so much. Yeah, y'all, so that was just Desiree's lunch people, um, the cafeteria people, trying to make sure she get lunch and everything like that. But we out of here. We won't be feeding her that shit no more. So that's yeah, what you'll so be saying. Get, like some more um, personal items. Like I said, it's a new routine. So everything's going to be different. Maybe we can do that for a video, like shopping for a part of our new routine, something like that. But, yeah, so as of right now, what we're about to do. Probably get her walking a couple more times. I just want to make sure everything's packed up. Get her walking down the hallway one more time before we actually leave. Ask a couple questions to the doctors and different things, and then we'll be right up out of here. But now it's game time. It's game time. It's me and you. 
me and you. I know. I know, right? So, uh, y'all stay tuned. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Y'all make sure y'all go ahead and click that like, comment, subscribe button. We are the DMZ family. If this is your first time hearing about us, we would love to have you a part of our family. And enjoy this video. So, we'll be back with y'all soon. So we did a couple TikToks and stuff like that. But we're about to put our baby down. We're going to take one little walk through the hallway. Just so Desiree can kind of, um, you know, get into her movements. Yeah. So. Get this body moving, guys. Hopefully she don't wake up. I know. Okay, she I think she's good. good. So we're going to head out into this hallway, take some pictures and stuff like that. Some memories, and then we out. So what is the pain you're feeling right now from somebody that just had a C-section? If somebody will potentially have to get a C-section in the future. The cut burns. Like, I guess it's healing, so it feels like it burns so bad. Like, I don't know, it's hard to explain. Like, it's it's just, I don't even know. So what is that you got on right there? So this is a um, compression. This helps, like, my uh, uterus and everything go back into place. And it helps you shave your body back, basically. Okay. And that's what they gave you? Yep, that's what they gave me. And that's what you get after a C-section? Yes. Maybe, is it best that we don't walk? Yeah, I don't think we should have. For real? No. Oof. It burns that bad? It burns, like, imagine, like, I don't know. I don't even know how setting your body on fire is, but this is it. Burns like comment down below if you had a C section before y'all and, and is that one of the the um the effects and the healing process because oh. wanna make sure you're good before we leave here. I'm sweating. Now you sweating? Yeah. Alright, so no walk. I don't know, I wanna wait a minute. <laughs> so we'll see. Alright. now that we are not walking anymore. Oh my god, my stomach is growling. <sighs> I'm so hungry, y'all. Ah, Lee, hold on. <sighs> All right, so now that we're not walking, ugh, excuse me, so now that we decide that we're not walking no more due to Desiree's pain, right? Now it's time to get to this right here. So I gotta size this, I think, to a smallest point. Um, I like this. Desiree is over there breastfeeding right now. So this is, this is very, 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 like, I don't even know what to say. This is a very, like, different, like, this is crazy. All right, y'all, so I just loosened the car seat um, straps. So basically all I had to do is go in here, press a little button right here, hold it down while I pull. I didn't pull too much because she is tiny. So hopefully this is good enough. We're going to try to put her in there in a second. And yeah, so right now it's going to be difficult because she sleeps. She just got milk drugged. And it, Another thing I got a question about, drop down below in the comments what you all feel about like breastfeeding on camera. I know you go some places sometimes in the mall, you see a woman just breastfeeding in the middle. You know, they pass the laws and stuff like that. So what do y'all think about that? I ain't gonna say nothing, you know what I'm saying? But what do y'all think? So now it's time to put her in the car seat. Isaiah is actually holding her. Oh, she just... oh. Isaiah is actually holding her right okay. now. Okay. And all she wants to do is be up under me, all so. Right, let's see. Let's put her in. I love this car seat, y'all. Oh. Oh. That fits her perfectly, y'all. Look at this. This is perfect. I thought, because we had another one, y'all. And um, the only we had, it was kind of like what we had for Jay. And Jay was kind of like the size of this when she was born as well. So when we put her in the car seat, she was literally like falling inside of the car seat. So I was like, we gotta get a better one this time. So I feel like this is way better. Like it holds her up, neck support, head support, just in case like she fall asleep, she not her head, not leaning to the right too much. I like this is perfect. So we're about to uh, get everything together because we're about to leave and I'm about to hold this car seat on my lap. So let me get this done first. And once I get inside of the, uh, the wheelchair or in the car i'll get back on the camera and update you guys so y'all just stay tuned all right y'all the baby is officially strapped in first car ride is on the way yeah i love this car seat i love it's this beautiful. Seat. i feel like it snugs her yeah so good choice mama good choice
Desiree's Rich gonna sit down because we thought we almost dropped the camera and her reflex was to jump for it and she hurt her stomach. But I'm going to take these bags right here to the car, take all this stuff and um, kind of avoid and, and get that out the way. Not avoid, get, just get that out the way and then come back up here with the girls so I can actually be able to record this process and show y'all that. This is our last day here and we're finally going home. Yes. This is gonna be very different. Here we go. You ready? We out. See you later. <laughs> How you feeling? Good. I get to go outside. That was in the middle of the night though. Like two o'clock in the morning on Valentine's Day. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what? Four days? I don't know. Maybe to the first floor. Ooh. Wow. Ooh. We out here. All right, y'all. So the baby is in the car. There's a ray is getting in the car right here. The lighting is messed up, but see y'all when we get in. You got it. You got it. It's game time now. Yeah. All right, I'm in, Excuse Please my miss. back seat. But Having kids, man. It's, uh, I'm in. Good job, babe. Whew, we did it. Yes. We did it. Yes. So, as you guys have seen, we have made it. I already made it in the car before. We just made it to Walmart because I do have some prescriptions to pick up since I did have a C-section. And it's going to help with my pain, ease my pain. And also, while I'm here, I want to get me some more... Um, like gas relief because that's the main thing that causes pain after you have a c-section if you have buildup gas so we're here right now unfortunately i can't go in because i can't do a lot of walking too much and we don't have a stroller for the baby so isaiah's gonna go in for me and grab a couple of the items that i have sent him and yeah um after that we should be heading home let me tell y'all like in a car going over a bump with my stomach feels so weird. It feels like I'm on a roller coaster, y'all. Like, it's different. But, I don't know. I'm just excited to not be pregnant no more. I'm excited that everything went well. Like, I'm still here. The baby's here. Like, you know, I'm just excited about life. So, yeah. So, um, once Isaiah comes from here, we're going to go in the car. We're going to go back home. And then we're going to show you guys Jade, you know, welcome us back to the house. I know she's going to be extra excited because she's been saying, Mommy, Mommy, Mommy. He coming home? I'm like, baby, I'm coming home tomorrow, okay? I'm excited to see her. But yeah, so that's pretty much it for right now. We'll let you guys know as this vlog goes throughout the day, like what else we're going to be doing. And yeah, so you have anything else to say, babe? No, I'm just on daddy duties. You know, very... <laughs> precise about how I'm driving now. I could drive crazy and everything. So I'm um, just going to go in there and get this stuff and then I'll be right back. All right. So we have officially made it home. I am out the car. Isaiah is actually getting baby girl out of the car right now. Um, I'm so excited to be home. It feels great to be at home, like out of the hospital. Uh, I just feel good. So it wasn't too bad getting out the car. It's still like just a little pain, so I'm gonna take some pain medicine once I get inside the house. And yeah, I can't wait to show you. Know, I can't wait to surprise Jay going in the house because I don't think she know we're here. She know we're here. Mm -hmm. Jay know we're here. No. So yeah, I can't wait to go inside show y'all her reaction of me coming home, which is gonna be a very big deal because she's been waiting for this moment. So let's get into it. Let's get inside the house, and I'm hungry. So we're about to go in. If we get Jay's reaction. Yes. Oh. Aww. 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 <laughs> this is so cute. <laughs> right, let me close the door. Wow. Pieces, you know, but yeah, this is so cute. We were waiting for like 
10 minutes on one knee. Thank you guys. It was good. It was great.